Alola friends, Dapper Drabby here, and welcome back, welcome back to the nonchalant Nuzlocke, the Pokemon Ultra Sun uh, playthrough on this channel. Uh, we are going to go ahead, we're going to check out what our team is real fast here. Uh, we have Victor at level 7 and Rufio at level 10. Uh, Victor is a uh, Grubbin. That we caught on Route 1, and as we, it is a Nuzlocke, this is the only Pokemon we can catch on Route 1. Now, we are hoping to get a third party member today by going to the trainer school, but we're just going to have to see what happens. So, there is our Rufio and Victor, um, but let's go ahead. We're in the Pokemon Center right now. Um, we seem to be healed up, so let's just go ahead and go to the trainer school and see what we can find there. Um... Looks a little blue. Let's just go ahead. We'll just do it. If I end up changing the voices again, you know what it is. I just change the voices from time to time. Here we are. You see, the trainer school is... There's a Toro sound. I wonder what that means. It's a... What in the world? What in the world? I'm going to catch like 30 of those. Well, looks like we won't be going that way anytime soon. Thanks to Tauros there. Let me know if this one's blurry. I'm trying to fix it from last time. Last time was super blurry. So this is a little different. I'm trying to like, you know, get it get it focused in, guys. Um, but we were only planning to go as far as the trainer school anyways. Just leave. Leave that for someone else to deal with. Come, follow me. We're going to follow Lily into the darkness. Hmm, do you think we'll find this something? I, I never catch his, his, his vo voices soon enough. Look at the trainer school, guys. Talk about a thumbnail action right there. Hey there, Dapper Drabby. I, I must have passed you two somehow. Somehow. But welcome to the trainer school, the place to learn to be a Pokemon trainer. <laughs> Professor Kukui, is this the child you told me about? Yeah, Dapper Drabby's a real tough one, too. Put him through the ringer, good teach. Four trainers, the Kukui way. You gotta beat four Pokemon trainers here at the school, Dapper Drabby. The experience will surely help you and your Pokemon grow stronger, yeah. Actually, speaking of experience, why don't you take this? And turn it off. Take it and turn it off. To keep that experience share on, yeah, all your Pokemon on your team will get experience from battle. The trainers will take part in this lesson, maybe inside or outside of the school. You may also want to visit one of our classrooms. You will learn things there that will help you on your journey, I'd say. All right, let the lesson begin. She may look, she may not look all that tough, but that teach, teaches her kids right. One of them's even a captain. Blah blah blah. Kukui species. Uh, move types work best in battle. Wondering about tall grass. Meet lots of different Pokemon. Help with them battle all the time. Yeah. Um. Yeah. You have to beat four trainers. Good luck, Powell. You bet you can do it. You bet you can do it. Blah. So let's go ahead and get the item here. It is a, a potion. Oh, first things first. I'm the realist. Um, I'm going to turn off that experience share. It is not needed. It does not want to be on. Okay, run. Run, run faster. So what I'm going to do is actually go into the grass first catch something and we'll see if it's different um but it probably won't be <sighs> i ran into something and that something will be an alolan meow so let's catch this alolan meow um actually i don't know which one i'd prefer the technician version or the uh the fur coat version Go grubbin, mud slap. This is a male meow. 
So maybe I'll name it Mom's Cat. Mud slap did nothing. So we might be here a while. We're gonna go ahead and mud slap this guy down. Lower his accuracy so he cannot hit us. Actually, let's go ahead and see if a Pokeball will work here. Go Pokeball. Because if we can catch him at a higher level or higher HP, why not? There we go. We got ourselves. No! The triple jiggle and everything. Oh, meow. You're killing me, Smalls. You're killing me, Smalls. I think that's your new nickname. This guy's earning all the nicknames already. Scratches. Scratch and weaves. I gotta think of a good nickname for Meow. Mom's cat just doesn't seem right anymore. Breaking free. I like to name things that when they break free multiple times. There we go. We got the Meow. It is man. It is man. It is a man. Meow's data will be added to the Pokédex. The Alolan Meowth. So we have a dark type now. That really changes our team a bit. It's impulsive, selfish, and fickle. It's very popular with some trainers who like to give attention to get who likes to give it the attention. It is a scratch cat Pokemon. I want to name it Payday. Or that yeah, it's white. Um, but it definitely earned its nickname Smalls. It's, you're killing me, Smalls. If you guys know what movie that's from, make sure to leave that comment. Like, leave the comment of that movie. What it? What's that movie? Huh? What's that movie? Uh, Smalls has been added to our party as a third party member. Now, what am I missing out on here? There's other Pokemon here, I'm sure. Um, I know in the Sun and Moon game, it was Alolan Grimer that you could find here. Which was super early in the game. But what do they have here in the special Sun version? Nope, more Meowth. Victor! Victor, you can beat it now. Go ahead and Vice Grip him. So our, our goal here is we need to beat all four trainers. So let's go ahead and, after this Meowth, go ahead and, and get a... Go against the first one. Wow, that did nothing. Um, I'm gonna need Ro Rufio in here. Rufio! 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 It's got bite already? Whoa. This might be... It's not worth it. It's not worth it to try to take on this Meowth. It's going to take too long to beat him down. Our team is just not strong enough. So let's go ahead. We'll battle this guy first. He's got himself that Elolan Grimer. Which may take a minute to take down. Oh wait, we have Victor. Victor has that Mud Slap. Here's the youngster Joey. Why doesn't he have an Elolan Rattata? Or our Lolan Joey, as I like to call him. Let's start with a Grub Grub. Grub Hub. Mud Slap. This thing's weak to that, right? It's super effective and does no damage. But, at least we'll be able to uh, avoid everything. So let's just Mud Slap. Until we can't Mud Slap no more. Ooh, we're poisoned. Now we might have to use the uh, Pokemon on me. That did a lot of damage. Uh, this is a risk I should not have taken. Ah, uh, he hit. And then the poison. Ah, oh, he survived. Get out of there, Victor. Get out. We're going to Smalls. Oh man, no, never mind. Smalls has a terrible moveset. Uh, we're gonna go into the uh, Rufio, our starter. 
That's right, he's our starter. We got rid of Oliver. We just didn't even trade for him. Uh, let's fire Fang and see what happens here. Decent damage. Poison gas. Good, we missed it. Happy hour, because I like money. Happy hour is like payday, but better. <laughs> Grammar looks green on the screen. Sorry, still working on my colors. Can't get them quite right. But there we go. We beat down the Alilah and Grimer. We have to do the care. So you'll see this little stylus here on the bottom screen. Uh, no, the Grimer found tall grass near the school was defeated. That's right, Joey. <laughs> I know, Grubs. You got into something nasty there. Come on, go away. Go away. Go away. There we go, there we go. You're all better. Thanks, Grubs. Victor. Grass type Pokemon are immune to poison powder, but things like poison powder and sleep powder, but you can still poison with poison gas. Um, so we're weak now. Is there another item? That's another item. So the antidote, I'm, I, it was, it's telling you you need the antidote against Joey. Ah, oh, come on, another wild battle. These things are too strong for me. What? Zorua is in the grass by the trainer school? That is crazy. That is crazy. Um, Victor, you do not have the strength to run. Zerua. Wow, I wish I would have called that. Zerua instead. That would have been sweet. Oh, he leered me. So we're going to fight Fire Fang it up. And none. Oh, we got the burn. So Scratch is going to do nothing. Nice. And burn does not take him out. Ah, oh, this sucks. It's literally, like, perfect. Perfect to catch the Zerua right now. Um, if somebody later asks for a Zerua, I'm going to be so mad. Because I won't be able to find him again. But we're going to take out the little illusion fox here. With the better wolf. Just like they do in the TCG. Rock Rush take out Zeruas. So let's just go ahead and go heal real fast. Um, I'm trying to get through this though. Don't want to run out of time. I do want to check out as much as possible of this. But it just might be one of those situations where I might not have enough time. Trick Rotom, pay attention. Heal my things, they are hurt. We got the grub, we got the rock rub, forget the little me out. Run away. Back to the trainer school. Cause we need to learn how to be a trainer. So let's go ahead and face off against the girl on the right side here now. My precious bonsai takes damage in a Pokemon belt. I'll use a potion on it. Uh-oh. So we'll just mud slap this thing to death until we can too. It's gonna have high defense, but not high special defense, so... These things do have fake tears like 90% of the time this early though. Fake tears are terrible. They lower your defense or your special defense so bad. Mud shot. It's super effective and does no damage. Super sand attack is basically what Mud Slap is. I remember they gave it out as a TM in Generation 2, which was like funny. It's like that was the bird's way of like taking out your rocks, was Mud Slapping your accuracy until it, you can't see them. 
I remember like not knowing that when I first went in there. And I went in with like a level 7 Onyx and got destroyed by Pidgeotto. Oh no. Don't do that. Flailing me. No, there's the potion, the faded potion. Luck with the accuracy, I've been lowering every single time though. It's right, Bonsly. You can't see me. Ooh, crit. Nice grubbing. Nice grubs. Good job, Beat Door. Another mud slap. Victor, one two punch. Oh my man, Victor MVP, Mr. MVP. You caused me a lot of pain there. Flailing Victor to almost dead. Ugh. You can help your Pokemon by using the right items on them at the right time. So, speaking of right items, right time, let's not. Let's not go to Quick Link, that was weird. But let's go to our bag. We have 10 potions. I'm not gonna run back to the Pokemon Center again, so we're just gonna throw a potion onto Victor and get out of here. Move along. They're blocking the stairs. You stinking me out. Why do you always love to park right at the base of the stairs? Because of me out. Hey, what do you give me? Look at your Pokemon. Whether it has a claw or not, you probably get a kick out of this one. The Quick Claw. Who do we have that's slow, though? I probably grubs. True, I'll give it to Grubs then. Some, some items don't do anything unless you get them to a Pokemon to hold. Wink, wink, ha, ha. Give Pokemon items to use. Let's give it that Quick Claw. I mean, what else are we going to do with it? What's in this door? This is a classroom. These kids give you items. PP up. Power points to utilize attacks. Petting Pokemon makes me happy. I can read. Oh, this is one of the trainers. Look at my Metapod. It's got an orange berry. Yes, yes it does. So, this might run a little long. Longer than 20 minutes. I really want to get through this training school. Um, I'll take fast forward 3 minutes. If uh, you guys don't want to see these last two battles. Um, they might take a bit. Because like this one's a Metapod with Orenberry. And I'm really just going to vice grip my way through it, as long as Victor can handle it. I mean, I could just Fire Fang with Brock Ruff, which is probably a better option. But to be honest, this is the way I would play the regular game. Like, Metapod has no chance to take out Victor. And I can easily methodically just... Tap A until Metapod's dead. That's what I always did in yellow version. Ah, tackle back. Illegal Metapod. It doesn't, it's not supposed to have tackle. Is that the good? That's the good. Nice. Vibe script being base 50 is super nice for Victor. It lets it take out a lot of things. Yeah, you have a berry. Um, I think she gives me a berry. 
Yes, she gives me berry. <laughs> Metapod looks cute. Who told you this? They're lying to you. Um, I think that's the last trainer, yeah. So let's go outside and face the, uh, the junior champion. These guys are fun, but they just ask you what, what's, what's the type that they didn't choose. Which one wins? Fire or grass type? Fire. Gives you that, like, bell sound that you gotta correct. But they give you nothing. Um, uh, it's not this field. It's this field. Battle me. Battle me, fool. Looks like you beat everyone else, huh? But don't think you beat me the same way. Ekans' ability is gonna get ya. Which is why you, you switch out. Honestly, why you switch out. So we are challenged by the rising star, Joseph. Joey, get out of the game. <laughs> the door. The intimidate. Ah, lowering the attack. The funny thing is I'm attacking with special attack first. No, not the broken wrap. Luckily, it's not, it's not broken in this game. But I think I'm stuck out here until I get rid of it. Until it wears away. So his move is intimidate you and then wrap you to death. Victor, don't flinch. Uh-oh. Yep, time for another potion, guys. The floating stick is going to heal you. The floating stick is going to heal you, Victor. Floating stick. 25. And he wrapped me again. Can I be freed from wrap? No, I can't. Mud slap. You got two more to go. Rad bug. This guy is kind of annoying. There's half his HP though. And his accuracy drop. Man, that rap is whittling. Whittling me down. And I flinch, right? Stop. A crit! There we go, he's free from rap. Um, I'd let him take the kill normally, but I'm gonna switch him out this time because I want Meowth to get a little bit of experience here. Unless he heals, then I'm gonna switch over to, uh, to Rock Ruff. Yo! But we should be able to just scratch him here and take him out. There you go, Meow. I set him up so you can knock him down. Left him with that 10 HP. And we grew to level 6 with Smalls. There we go. The attack it needed was Bite. Now it's got Stab Bite at level 6. Awesome. There we go. We beat everybody. Intimidate his ability that lowers your opponent's attack stat. If you understand Pokemon abilities, you can use the best strategy in, ba in battles. But whatever, take this. It's a tuck the machine. Work up. That used to be a TM for a gym as well. This is not exactly a gym, but... You learn. First thing you need to know about TMs is they're not like old TMs. You can actually teach them to anybody at any time. And they never die. School bell. <clears throat> Attention all students, will Dapper Driver please come to the office on the second floor? Dapper Driver to the second floor office please. Uh oh, I'm in trouble. I think I'm fired guys. What terrible thing did you do to get called to the office so soon? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go with nothing. That's what you say. Are you in trouble? I'd head up to the second floor as soon as you can. Run, 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 run. I can't. The cat's in the way, right? 
Cat's gone. Cat's gone. Cat's up. Open the locker. Where's this door go to? Is that an office downstairs? Um, oh, I'm gonna avoid her. This is the office, right? I wanna go this way. Aha, I made it past her. What's in this door? In door number one, you have a slow It's, oh, I'm tired now, guys, yawn. <sighs> that attack worked on me. <sighs> oh, we're inside too. Wake up, Rotom. Stay awake, dude, stay awake. What does this button do? It's another classroom with people in it. Um, I don't wanna learn. But what do you say? Abilities, blah, blah, blah. I think Rotom fell asleep on me, guys. Let's see what the teach got to say. Deborah Drabby, I can't believe that you, you beat all my students, fantastic. After such, seeing such a performance, I'd like to battle you myself. What do you say? Are you ready to take me on? Uh, mm, uh, sure. Yeah. Good. I hear f about you from Professor Kukui. I'll challenge you with a Pokemon that has a type advantage against Rowlet. So choose your partner. Uh, type advantage against Rowlet. That could be, like, a Lissapod. A lot of things have type advantage against Rowlet. Kukui, you gave her the little cat. Alright, I'm gonna have some cat battles, guys. Some cat battles. Ooh, never mind. Level 10. Back away slowly. Oh my. Level 10 lit, and I hope this dog can chase it off. Let's go, Rufio! Oh. Happy hour. I didn't ember me. I like money, guys. It's it's really like my favorite thing in this game is money. Let's bite and see if we can flinch him. We're gonna end right after this battle, actually. Uh, we'll pick up next episode right where this one left off. Rufio! That did nothing. Did it burn? Didn't even burn. So let's go ahead and potion up our little Rufio here. Once I get that uh, written into the yellow, I think she's going to end up using an item. So I'll see if I can set it up for that final knockout with uh, Meowth again. It's small. Bite him! Bite him! Bite him, Rufio! Just let me know if you guys have any suggestions. That works. We just cut the lit. Cut the lit and... Rufio gains that experience. Vika Volt. Vika Victor gains that. Sensational! You received 960... $9.60 for winning. Nice, maybe you'd take over as teacher for me here. <laughs> All joking aside though, I do want to take you these I do want you to take these for me. A little reward for beating me. Five great balls of fire. Now hopefully I can save. No, I can't save. No! Know your Pokemon and their moves. The basic for being a trainer. How about it? Uh what's the voice? I'll give him, I'll give him the Michael Caine voice because I have nothing better to do. I'm Michael Caine. Greetings, Captain Alima here. Couldn't help but observe your battles. You look so very delightful in battle that I had no ch choice but to be summoned here. Uh, oh yeah, this is Dapper Jabby who just moved here from Alola to Alola from Kanto. He's got the real sense for how to use moves, and I think he's gonna go far as a trainer. Yeah. Hmm, I see. Then, welcome, newcomer. Newcomer. I look forward to seeing your brilliance in the moves in my trial. Indeed, we captains are the ones who conduct the trials. Your, 
you will face on our on your way to challenging the island Kahuna. My trial is held in Verdant Cavern. The trial Captain the trial of Captain Ilima. You can find Pokemon living everywhere, even in patches of tall grasses in Halloui City. Perhaps you want to fill out your team a bit before attempting my trial. I sincerely look forward to your challenge. Wow, like totally dissed is there. Oh yeah! Oh, that was her. I reported to the folks upstairs about Taurus blocking the road out in front again. That guy's tour is pretty much a celebrity here on Melee Melee, you know. Well, I guess it's time to dismiss you from school, Dapper Drabby. I get the bell. Dapper Drabby has completed the lessons of Dada School. Oh! And you guys were there with me. You were there with me when. Be good to your Pokemon and try to follow through with those status conditions too. Words. Words. And words. And words. Words. Show them what you're made of, Dapper Drabby. Next, let's go to the Pokemon Center. You seem to be perfectly synced up with your Grubbin, weren't you? Um, since we've come this far together, why don't we... Why don't I show you more of the city? Come on, there's lots to see. Like the shopping mall. I had a perfect voice for her like two episodes ago, and I don't know what it was. So guys, we're going to end it off there. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. And did I walk down? Because I don't think I walked down. I think it's just going to keep going here. And like, never let you stop. Uh, I know it's really interesting to see you battle. I feel like you give it your off. Pokemon's sake, I think that's why you saved Nebby that time. <sighs> There's a Taurus. Wow, this is just like, I can't end. Oh, and other voices, and other voices. Oh, if it isn't Lily and Dapper Drabby. Sorry for scaring you, friend. I guess it's just time I get old Taurus back home. But you've got an idea. Why not give him a little pet, Dapper Drabby? Are you going to pet that big old Taurus? I bet it's chastised. It's a hundred times smoother. What? Huh, where will you be petting horse? Pet its face, stroke its mane, grab it by the tail. Um, stroke its mane? It's confused by that. Hmm, that doesn't seem to impress Taurus very much. Will you be petting it? Grab it by the tail. Be a jerk. It likes it. Weird Taurus. Hmm, that doesn't seem to be impressed very much. Really? It just wants you to pet its face? Okay. Haha, <laughs> you'll see that. This rascal already loves you. Pokemon become happier when you show them some care. Care! Wah! All the places you'll go, child. As And as you do, I will surely be there. Surely meet more Pokemon and people who will enrich your life. Bye, Tutu. The Kahunas are really something, eh? Able to calm a raging beast without even needing a battle? Now that's something. I mean, like... Taurus is plenty and all. I mean, I like plenty. Yeah. But that's pretty crazy. Pretty scary. I don't think I want to ride on it. So, where are you two off to now? I was thinking I could show Dapper Drabby. Oh. I was thinking I should. I could show Dapper Drabby around Halloween City a bit. Nice idea. You're trying to be on top of things, Lily. Dapper Drabby, just go out there to Alola, huh? Let me tag along, too. I want to go get something good to eat and smell my feet. All right, let's go all together. What are we waiting for? This way, come on. Sorry, how we're just not friends like that. This is not X and Y. We're not that close. Oh, how? I guess we should catch up before him before he gets too far, Dapper Jabby. Halloween City is the biggest city in Alola. Which is why we are saving now. So thank you guys so much for coming out. This has been Dapper Jabby. I'll bid you guys a Lola and tune in next time for another exciting episode of the Pokemon Ultra Sun Nonchalant Nuzlocke. But thank you guys so much for coming out. I'll bid you guys Alola. Bye bye now.